Pirate Bear Gang. Me and Jeremy are gonna go ahead and take on Target today, you know, during this uh, pandemic. Um, yeah, we gotta get a couple odds and ends, nothing too crazy, but we're taking Logie. Collie Bear, Logie Bear, Kennedy Bear, and Delaney Bear back there, so. We are gonna go in, see how empty the shelves are, see what everybody's crazing about. What do you have to say, baby? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> you wanna say hi? Hi. Say, what's your name? Collins. Collins. Okay, well we're gonna vlog once we get up in the store, see what's going on. This is on. Jeremy's target face. Yes, I'm are starting to look pretty shitty. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't nobody wiping their ass around here. Good thing we're all stocked up. We're good. Yeah, the white what the wet wipes for the booty, right? Nice and clean. <laughs> what do you think about this? Yeah, yeah. Personally, that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. All right, so we just came out of Target and uh, uh, I think this stuff is crazy, man. This uh, whole uh, coronavirus and quarantine, everybody putting everybody isolating everybody. I get the purpose of it, but in the same aspect, it's pretty crazy. People are going OD with the toilet paper. I don't understand. What's the purpose of the toilet paper and the paper towels? Like, go buy everything now that they're limiting everything one per, per guest because everything's being used. You guys comment down below. Let me know what you think, what your thoughts is about this whole epi epidemic of this uh, coronavirus thing. Um, obviously, I'm going to keep myself away from people to not get myself infected with it, but nonetheless, I mean, I feel like it, every day you should always wash your hands. You should probably always be good with your hygiene, you know, and if you're doing those things, you can prevent this stuff that's happening. But we just got done doing a little bit of shopping at Target. It's crazy how all these stores, grocery stores, everything is like... What? shelves empty completely empty a bunch of stuff that you usually receive fulfilled filled up empty but we're gonna go ahead and get in the car get up into momzilla and we will catch you guys in a little bit like i said comment down below let me know your guys thoughts and your opinions on this whole coronavirus thing me i think people are going a little bit overboard but you guys let me know what you think catch you in a minute Uh, it is my son's birthday, JJ, our son's birthday, mm -hmm. and uh, obviously knowing the quarantine situation and all the stuff being down, held down because of the coronavirus, my kids are prolonged in Minnesota with their mother because of the situation, so technically, or, originally, okay, we're going to call JJ, okay, but originally he was supposed to be here for his birthday, usually he is here for his birthday. But given the situation and the circumstances, he is still in Minnesota, so we're just going to call him and we're going to tell him happy birthday because as you guys can hear, Logan, look at his hair, y'all did his hair again. Where are you going? I'm going to Auntie House. You going to Auntie House? He got his little backpack and everything with all his belongings and stuff. He's ready to go. See, I got on the merch and my beautiful lady just woke up, so don't mind how she's looking right now. No. Right now. Oh, she woke up, so... You would, you know you would have told me that off of camera, so we gotta make sure we say that. Right. But we're gonna call my son right now. We're gonna wish him a happy birthday. Logan, come on, let's say happy birthday to JJ. Hello. Say happy birthday. Happy birthday. You hear him, JJ? Thank you, Logan. Say love you, JJ. Hello, JJ. Love you, Logan. Happy birthday, son. Thank you, Dad. You all ready to party and uh, turn up for this big one four? You feel Happy like birthday, a... JJ. Thank you, Melissa. Yep. You know a big guy. Man, we were gonna party in style here. Now you're all the way up in Minnesota. Bye bye. Yeah, it's this coronavirus. Yeah, I know. I was telling, I was saying that if he was, usually he'd be here for your birthday, but oh well. Yeah. That's fine. You'll do you'll do something fun up there. So I just wanted to call you and tell you happy birthday. That's all I really wanted to call you and say, son. I'm about to okay. get ready. About to get ready to go to get ready for work and stuff. So, but I love you. I hope you enjoy your day, and I hope you enjoy being 14 years old. Love you and thank you. 
You know what dad's gonna say, only four more years till you're 18. Yeah. <laughs> All right, love you. Love you too. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. What I do, Bear Gang? We are back, baby, with another video. And today's video is something a little bit more special for you guys to get to know us better. We just you decided in this quarantine, we uh, figured out a little bit better uh, suggestion for a video. And my lady came up with this one. So babe, what are we doing? Q&A, baby, Q&A. Q&A. So we have our answers here. We have 10 questions we're gonna ask each other. We're gonna see who knows who better. I think I know her better. I think I'm gonna win this already, but we gotta wait and see. Man, so uh, also what we would like to say is uh, shout out to my guy Nino for uh, Tag in the back of my garage wall. Um, he did a pretty good job. That is my tattoo artist. His link will be down in the description below as you see it on the screen right now. Make sure you go give him a follow on the IG. Dope dude, really cool guy. But uh, nonetheless, we appreciate him for doing this. Um, other than that, during this video, we would like, if there's questions you guys would like us to ask one another, maybe for a future video, Comment down below, let us know, because we always appreciate your guys' feedback. And uh, comment down below, let us know what kind of questions you guys can come up with. If it ain't, <laughs> if it ain't too crazy, we might just answer. But if it get a little too crazy, man, then we might not answer. But nonetheless, we're gonna get to this video. I got my cousin, Daniel. Ayo is Coop gang, gang. on the IG. You see it on the screen, he is behind the cameras. He's the one asking the questions. We have the answers in our hand. So, these questions are geared to ask. The questions are 10 questions, then we got a bonus question, which I created one for her, and she created one for me. So, we're gonna see how this go. Let's get to it, baby. All right, question number one. Who has been going crazy more in this quarantine? Who's answering first? I can. Lady first, so go ahead. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you say you? Why? Yeah. Yeah, because A, I'm on maternity leave. B, I don't feel safe. Like, it, this is just all too eerie to me. Like, shutting down martial law. You know, we're gun toting state, but little things feel a little bit unsecure. What's your answer? Did you show your card? Ling Bao. For my answer, she hit it right on the ball. I said, <laughs> lady. She's been going nutty professor. Oh, let go of my hand, you fat mo Say one more word, buddy, I'll tear your arm off. Oh. Yeah, she's been going crazy. No. No, but not that bad. Not that bad. I could go I way mean, crazier. I mean, she's quarantined in the house and she's been like she said, she's been on maternity leave, so she's been in the house a lot. Talking to now, a toddler and a newborn yeah. for ten to fourteen hours a day, it's intense. And the newborn just all she wants is the booby booby booby. So <laughs> mommy is sitting down and giving booby all day. Just like her dad. <laughs> Alright, question number two. What's my worst habit? Uh, this is a very great one for my lady, and she probably could vouch for this. This is my lady's worst habit. Not picking up after herself. <laughs> she, is, she is very terrible. Only up let's let's no, no, no. specify. Wait, this is this is this is, this is my answer, and I'm answering it. So my lady is terrible. She terrible at what? At, at, at picking up after yourself. That means everything as far as picking up. She get out the shower, falls on the floor. She does her hair. We now mind you guys. We got this. We redid our bathroom, our master bathroom in our bedroom. We redid it. So this uh, vanity has things where she can put her flat iron, her curling iron, all that stuff. It's got cubbies for it, and it's got power outlets. Guess what she does with it? She leaves it on the counter. Yeah, well, we got a toddler that goes in the cabinets, so. Uh, don't blame yeah, it on Logan. There is a rhyme to my madness. She trying to blame Logan Berry, y'all. Yeah, what is your worst? Ask me that question again. What is Jeremy's worst habit? Dear God, he's got multiple, but <laughs> I'm gonna go in between these things. OCD, y'all. OCD and the ear thing. Show them your ear thing. Your ear thing. What ear thing? No, 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 no.
That thing. Dude, <laughs> yes. That is so annoying. Hey, look. You know okay, what I'm so, talking about? Have you seen it? It goes, so look, noom, if my, noom, if, noom, if, noom. If, if my throat itch, <laughs> I got. <laughs> yeah. And I itch it. Weird. And, and his kids do it too. That's the way. They follow, they follow after that shit. That's the point of the apes. One does it, Jordan. That's it. Nobody else does it. OCD, she probably got me on that one. I do yeah, that. Yeah, you were insane with it. Shout out to my mom. <laughs> shout out to my shout mom. Shout out to my dad. Because all that cleaning I did when I was younger with my dad, I'm a big clean freak. And then uh, the OCD part and just keeping everything like in a certain way, I got that from my mom because my mom was that way. Question number three, Melissa. Which social media network is Jeremy's favorite? IG for sure. IG. Show the card. Straight up IG. I to the G. And? Is that true? Uh, I'll say that in YouTube. That in YouTube? That in YouTube. I'm on both of those pretty often. Mines, I'd have to say the same thing from a lady. That's all she does. There's nothing else. <laughs> There's nothing else she does. Instagram is everything. She's on Instagram looking at you weirdos that DM her uh, your, 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 your balls and jangling on the ground or wherever it may be. Cut it out. Y'all need to chill. <laughs> this is my lady. We're like five kids deep. She ain't, she ain't you don't want to break. You won't ever get her, so just give it up. Stop sending those kind of weird old pictures because it, it ain't worth it. <laughs> Save yourself the headache and... Because Jeremy has to see it too. I, I straight show it. Like, <laughs> no, I don't hey. look at it. I don't you don't look, look at it, but I, I show you. She tells me about it. Just come on, cut it out. <laughs> Question number four, Jeremy. What is Melissa's favorite TV show? I, you know I, I hit this on the ball. Yeah, it's easy. My lady is one of the... This is her OCD. Right here, she loves this show. Dr. Pimple Popper. Hell yes. She loves to pop some pimples. She can see a small little bump on your face. She's like, let me pop that. Me Hell pop that. yes. It's, 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 and look, All bad. look, sometimes she'll pop a pimple and it'd be like a little bitty one. She'd be like, there's still more in there. I'm like, no, babe, there's blood coming out. It's enough. <laughs> you're right on that one, you're right. So what is your favorite TV show? Mm -hmm. This is kind of in between because I say it's either Sports Center because we watch a lot of that, or YouTube. We that, watch a lot of that. She hit it on the ball. Sports watch. Center is probably one thing I watch. That's the only thing I really watch on TV. Is Sports Center. You even get notifications to your phone. But uh, true. So you know, <laughs> I'm a big <laughs> sports fan. So I love football. Y'all know me. Y'all see the stuff on the wall back there. I'm a big Packers fan and always will be. I got it tatted on me. It's crazy. So. Question number five. Is it on Jeremy or Melissa? Either one. It's on Jeremy. You want to press last. All right. Jeremy. I'm going to get a drink of my water. <laughs> Cheers to that. Stay hydrated out there, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Question number five. Jeremy, what is Melissa's shoe size? Oh, I hit that on the ball. It's her favorite number. My lady's favorite number is the number nine, and that's what her shoe size is. You right. Yeah. What's mine? Oh, eleven. wait, 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 wait. Go ahead. Okay. Wait, it's yeah. eleven. Okay. I bought you tons of shoes. I already know <laughs> that shit. Is it on the card? Is that it's the only the size I can wear? You can wear eleven and a half. And what else? Ten and a half. There we go. You can scrunch like. your big ass toe into the some pins. Jordans. I've seen it before. If the shoe look good enough, I might try to put on a ten and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Question number six. Melissa, what is Jeremy's zodiac sign? A goddamn Scorpio. This dude is a Scorpio to the T. We can read. You should read the zodiac sign today. You really? You guys should. Probably this, you don't. It's this dude read. sitting in front of us. That is me to a T. Moody with a chance of uh, Moody. Okay, that was rough. So What's my mine? lady's sign is Libra. She is a Libra. September twenty third. What word does Jeremy use the most? <laughs> I love to hear this one. <laughs> <laughs> no! Yeah! For sure! No way! Yeah! For sure! Tall guy is not here. Heavy! Heavy tall guy, hitter! Tall guy is not here. Heavy okay. hitter on that. Yeah, I, to, I, uh. I give it to you because I, I, I use the word, but it depends on who I'm talking to. 
Yeah. I'll be yeah. talking to my lady and I'm, yeah, I'm not cool. me. I don't say those kind of words when I'm talking to her. But right, obviously my cousin Ayo is cool. Follow him on IG. When I talk to him sometimes, you know the word comes out a little bit, you know what I mean? They go crazy but on we it. Have a I plead the fifth. <laughs> <laughs> so I would say my lady's favorite word, and I, this is her favorite word to say to me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, That's right. What, yeah, you do. Yeah, right. You are crazy. Will you, will you? No, I call you annoying. No. Yes. <laughs> Man, camera's not on, okay? You can tell me the truth. <laughs> you say I tell you to fuck off a lot? You don't? <laughs> you don't? You're confused. Yeah. It's alright, you're getting old. He was way off on that, that's crazy. What is Melissa's favorite place to eat? Oh, that's no, this is no brainer. There's two, but I know this one outweighs that one. So, my lady loves this place. Pot bellies. She loved those sub sandwiches from there, a turkey one to be exact. She loved those things. Yeah, that's in Arizona. They got pot bellies other places. Comment down below if you ain't got pot bellies. Comment down below and let me know if you don't know what that is. But my lady loves pot bellies and I'm not big on it. So when I'm accommodating to her, I'm always like, okay, babe, let's go to pot bellies. When I'm paying. <laughs> Get out of here. What is Jeremy's favorite place to eat? Yeah, it's this place right here. It's both of our favorite place in the world, Mama's Pizza. Oh, yeah. I can't believe I can't believe you did that. That's Minnesota, that. though. So what? Favorite place to yeah, eat. I guess. Who has the crazier family, you or Jeremy? <laughs> Definitely Jeremy. <laughs> He's got like ten kids, a house, and a baby mama. He comes with it all. Yeah. Hold on, let me. I just say we got a pretty good close. It's probably equal. Who makes more money out of you and Melissa? No brainer. No brainer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I... Get a close look at that. I said, just kidding. <laughs> yeah. No, my lady, my lady's a breadwinner. She she makes she makes the bank. Melissa well, Bonds, baby. Yeah, she makes the bank. Going into the bonus round. Bonus round, right. baby. So this is the one I made, just so you guys don't think we finagling you. This is the one I made for my lady. I already know this answer. And this is her question. Read it. What's my biggest pet peeve? Eating with your mouth open, putting your elbows on the table. Those are pretty comparable. That's what you came up with. <laughs> I don't thought you had the other one. Shut all the doors. Every <laughs> single damn door people in our house is shut. Every one of them. Doesn't matter. He shuts all of them. Now, my son Logan does the same shit. He does. <laughs> Bonus round, baby. Show the answer. Oop. So, what's my favorite drink? So, that and that. What is my favorite drink? Vodka. Yeah. You comment down below. Say who won. I think I did. Not this guy. Loser. So we gonna ask my cousin Daniel. Yeah, I he's behind the screen. He's behind the scenes, so who you say won that? Well, including the bonus round, Jeremy took it. Yeah, right! <laughs> That's family alike. But oh, wow. but but yeah. but what? But what? Coming clean, I did tell him your answer when you turned around. So, <laughs> Melissa won. <laughs> yeah, everybody close your eyes. Sorry. It's on a pop it on his ass. Oh, uh, yeah. See, we gotta get unbiased. But, you won. I was pretty I won. cool. <laughs> you guys, comment down below. Let us know what you think about this and uh, how you think it went. Um, like I said, we answered the questions pretty legitimately, and uh, I think my lady, she probably did win. But yeah. Fun I, facts she, about Jeremy, you guys didn't know. Yep, that's true. So I bet your kids will be on this video being like, yeah, that's my dad. That's my dad. Yep, that's my dad. Other than that, man, we are out with another video. And like I said, you guys comment down below. Drop some questions. If there's other questions you guys would like us to answer, like I said, if they ain't too crazy. Well, we'll give it a we'll give it a shot and we'll make another video about this and do it again. Um, but comment down below, make sure you get this video a fat thumbs up, baby. And other than that, we're gonna catch you guys in the next video. Gang, gang, gang. Shh.